top. Our three man is right where you are. Our two man is in the left corner, and our four man is on the left block, right there. They call this a quick one. So this is Tony Parker. This is uh, Mark, LaMarcus Aldridge, or Duncan, okay? So as he comes down the floor, he's got, Tony Parker's got the whole side isolated. So if you have a really good guard, you come down and you take it for a quick one-on-one. -on -one. Really great late in the game when you need a bucket. Instead of coming down and launching three pointers up, you go quick one, he's got a quick one, one on one. If not, the trailer comes in and sprints into a ball screen right here. As he sprints into the screen, you're coming off, coming off, you popping for a shot, you're ducking in the lane right there, and you got the shooters behind the three. Okay, so it's a transition up into a quick pick and roll. If the guy can shoot, he rolls to the basket. If he can shoot, look, Marcus Aldridge, then you can pick and pop. You can even do this with twos, threes, if they can shoot the ball for your team. You put two really good players in this combination. Let's try it. Quick one, quick one. This is Spurs play. And a shot. All right, now, I want you on this one now, I want you to pop, I want you to duck in, I want you to, you're gonna get the ball uh, for a power layup right there, okay? So if you have a post player you can't shoot, you put him down where that four man is, okay? Great, you duck it, I want him really to duck right into the, right in the front of the rim. The reason we like the people to duck into the rim when we play pick and roll, it freezes the rotation to the guy that's the pick and pop guy. Because if they rotate, or some coaches call it X out to the shooter, now you got to lay up to that player inside. Really important, I'm just gonna just give you pick and roll defense, a pick and roll offense. When you set your pick, real quick, real quick. As you come off the pick, freeze, right there. When you come off pick, always come off. You be grabbed, two dribbles. Create spacing. The second thing, always come off the pick. Just shoot the ball. If you come off the pass, the whole object of pick and roll basketball is to get two players to guard the ball. Two guys on the ball. If I get two guys on the ball, I've done a good job as a coach. Because you're going to be open and someone else. Okay? That's one lesson. Here comes second play. And it, I'm sorry. We all got that? Good, good class. Can you clap for me? Okay. All right, this is Spurs play. We, this, I love this. This is called pick, pick, repick. Okay, here's my one man right here. My two man is in the corner. My four man is at the top right here. My five man is at the second trailer spot. And my three man is in the right corner. You're like at the opposite lane. You're at the top of the key right there. You're right there. Okay, so it's pick, pick. So as he comes down the floor, here's a pick right here, and you're popping. Pop, all right? You're coming off here. You're gonna try to turn the corner, and now, if you can, but now here comes re-pick. And re-pick is you're coming over, you pick and roll to the rim, you're coming off, and there's no one to hedge. There's no one to rotate, because you have shooters in both corners, and you gotta stay at home with this three-point shooter. So picture if you had one post player and everyone else were shooters and they switch everything, you don't care if they switch because now you're gonna have a point guard on your big man. Pick, pick, repay. That's literally their call. I'm giving them all the calls of the teams that we go over. Pick, pick, repay. First pick, second pick, repay. Layup. The key is shooters in the corner, freeze rotation. The whole object in offensive basketball is to understand coverages on your pick and roll. What is that team doing? Are they showing, blitzing, switching, going under, acting, all that stuff? Are we good? Gators, good? <laughs> all right, third play. San Antonio, they call it dive, rub, dive, rub. 
One man. Two. Three. Trailer five. Four men in the low block. Okay. So as they come down in their break, if they ever call dive, that means that the player that's the trailer, as soon as he starts to dribble to you, you back cut to the rim. Okay? So as, as he dribbles towards you, back cut right hard to the rim. Right to the rim. He, he, he dribbles over, and as that happens, you come up for a high pick and roll. Right here. When they use the word rub, San Antonio, that means middle pick and roll for them. So you're going to... You're backdooring and you're going to continue to that block. You're coming back on pick and pop shot. Okay? LaMarcus Aldridge, Robert Ory, players like that through the years. If you're a non shooter in this position, then you can roll. I'll also show you. So I'm going to first do it where you're going to roll. Okay? And I'll show you. So you're going to backdoor, clear. Well, hold on, hold on. Rewind, rewind. He's gonna dribble at him, he backdoors, you wait till he clears. Okay? Ready? Rub. Roll. Again, now, as, as he rolls, you can lift up foul line extended because the whole key is you wanna read who is rotating in this player. Now we're gonna do the same thing, you're gonna pick and pop for a shot. Dive rub. Got a hand for that, huh? <laughs> this is coaching at its best. This is like Popovich is here. Okay? <laughs> Except we're not going to do any interviews between commercials. Okay. Now, a lot of you guys are seeing a lot of teams now are icing. Some teams call it blue, pick and rolls. So on that, so what we mean by icing or blue is that 